Johnny, day three, nail biter just there after penalty shots. Overall impression, how your team played this weekend? I was, I, you know, I was proud of the boys. They got better each game. I, I think that uh, yesterday's games, although we uh, we did not come on top, we, we actually played better than the games that we won. And that's the way, especially youth soccer is sometimes. I think it's important for us coaches to let the players know that playing soccer the right way and being creative and expressing yourself on the field is is the most important thing whether the, the result is important for us but uh, the way the boys play and the way the boys express themselves I, I was happy with them uh, throughout the tournament and what would you say was your biggest takeaway from this weekend um, takeaways I, I, I think there's many takeaways I think uh, I think that the, the the competition is huge every 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 chance you get a to get to to get games like these uh, where you can get Houston Chicago even Vaughn soccer club OSU and Aurora they all provided great competition uh, you know it's only it's only it's only beneficial for us in terms of what we what we can do with our players and how we can teach our players effectively so I, I think that the the competition was 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 very good for us and lastly do you think this will be a a tournament that will continue to repeat. Oh yes, this is something that we, the MLS, that uh, Toronto FC, Tim Bezbachenko, everyone supports. I think it's important uh, for for us at the academy at Toronto FC to support youth soccer, and I think this is one of the ways that we can support youth soccer not only locally but also throughout the MLS in North America.